What's up everybody, it's Man of Low Moral Fiber here, my name's Luke, and I just wanted to do a quick check-in. I've been playing through some of these side quests, and I just got my first um, legendary drop in the game. This is a supernova shield, it looks like it's a orange Malawan shield, it says here, more energetic than your average nova, releases an incendiary nova, or incendiary nova, last when depleted, must recharge between novas, so I'll go ahead and put it on. Looks like it has quite a large capacity here, and I'll see if I can get an enemy to bust my shield. Where would this enemy be? Hmm, rescuing Pickle's sister right now, so um, I hope she doesn't kill that enemy. Where did this guy go? Not down here. Hmm. I don't know where this guy went. Oh shit, I missed the jump. I'm dead. <laughs> Damn it, this happens to be all the time in Borderlands the pre-sequel. Um, I'm sure I'm not the only person that it's happening to. But I was excited to go ahead and get a legendary drop there. I don't think that it is a guaranteed drop or anything. So that's pretty cool. Um, I actually have found two... Um, where is this guy? I actually have found two legendary items in a uh, vending machine. I found a pitchfork. And then I have also found... Um, oh crap, I can't remember the name of it. It was some other shield that I just couldn't afford. And I happened to find that one in Nisha, or not Nisha, Nina's, um, oh my god, Nina's little nurse station in, oh, there's that guy. Nina's nurse station in Concordia. Well, that was annoying. It was difficult to find and kill that guy. Well, I'm glad that Pickle's getting back together with his sister. Um, I'd like to show you guys this shield real quick. Hmm, so I'll have to find an enemy that could kill me. Or at least damage my shield. I'm a little bit over leveled right now because I've been doing all of these side quests. But, I think we might be able to find um, some enemies that can do damage to my shield here in Triton Flats. Um, right where you spawn in and if you go over which way is it right over here there's a bunch of these dark siders including some uh, unique variants there so I'm gonna let this guy bust my shield and we'll see if this Nova um, is going to wreck a couple of these dudes oh yeah <laughs> it killed them pretty easily so that was cool um, I'll use my Aspis to let the shield recharge real quick looks like it recharges kinda slowly that's not any good Perhaps I got one with bad parts. Alright, so we'll find some more enemies in here that could possibly um, damage my shield. And we'll see how we do against them. Alright, this guy's not going to cut it. There are two more dudes in here. Where are they? Ah, they must be upstairs. Alright. So there are some more unique enemies up here. This is actually a good little place to uh, level up a bit if you want because you can just save quit over and over again and these badasses will keep coming. And if you're, you know, struggling a little bit, this could be a good place, aw oh, man, to level up. I wasn't close enough with my Nova there, so so far this shield is a little bit underwhelming to me, but we'll see how we do. The um, action skill that Athena has is pretty damn cool to me. I like it quite a bit. Once I spec into the uh, Phalanx Tree, I expect it to be even more powerful. So I want my shield to recharge here so that I can uh, try to kill some things with it. Alright, good. Now we'll see if they uh, can lower my shield and if they you know, get killed by it. Where's multiple enemies? It'd be more impressive if the Nova managed to kill two things. 
So yeah, it seems to have a pretty damn powerful Nova. It's killing things pretty easily. I am a little bit over leveled, so it should be killing things pretty easily. Um, I'll test it out some more and see how we do with it. As always, guys, I do appreciate you watching. If you haven't yet taken the time to subscribe, please do so. I'd appreciate that. Otherwise, you know, I do, um, once again, thank you very much for watching. I know that this was kind of just a silly little video where I, uh, you know, got a legendary item and I wanted to show it to you guys. So, it was exciting. My first legendary item in Borderlands 3 sequel. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you in the next video, hopefully. Bye, guys.